Hi everyone, so I'm back with another challenge. In this challenge, you have to create a function which should be able to find our longest word in a sentence. And that function should be reusable. Just pause this video, try it on your own, then resume this video and compare your approach with my approach. Let's get started. So let's create a function. It will be find longest word. And it will take a parameter as a string. Let's call this function here. I will pass this string. I will simply console log the result, which will be the longest word. And here we'll make use of reduce function. But first of all, we have to spread this string by these spaces. So it will be message.split by spaces. I will simply return it here just to see the output. Save it. Open this file in the browser. So this is the output. As you can see, we got an array of strings or you can say array of words. Now we need to find the longest word in that array and simply return it. So let's make it that longest word. I'll make it just longest return it here longest and here we'll make use of reduce function so as you know it will take an honest function which will have two parameters current value and the previous value and we'll set the initial value to uh, empty string then we'll simply compare current value with the previous value and we'll compare it by the length so if current length is greater than the previous length then we'll simply return it otherwise we'll return the previous now just save it go to browser and this is the output so this is the longest word in this entire sentence now you might be thinking that a function is working as expected but there's some issue with this function for example if i'll put a couple of dots here like this then this is practically a word according to this function just save it and see the output see now we are not getting this uh, grammatically to fix this you need to write some regex so here I'll write a very tiny code. So message dot map. So we'll take each word in that array and we'll remove all these dots if they exist in any of the word. So word dot replace this thing. This is the regex which you actually need and we'll replace it with empty string. That's it. I'm not good with the regex, so just bear with me here. Now save it, and this is your output. So make sure you always use this replace function with the regex to remove any kind of a punctuation or special characters in a sentence. I hope you got the point, how it actually works. See you in the next video. Have a nice day.